Hello and welcome to your daily Capricorn Oracle reading. We are using the Power Animals of the Planet by Ellen Brenneman. So today is January 24th and it's Friday. And the chakras that we are working with is U and the Me. So it's the root chakra with the love chakra together. So it's like Ooh, me. So it's very beautiful. This is um, the basic trust and truth of your sexuality and feminine energy if you're a woman. And if you're a man, you can tap into that divine feminine as well with that love and healing through your heart chakra. So our power animal planet of the planets is the duck. And we've gotten the duck, I think, a couple times now for January 2020. So let's see what does the duck say for us. Ducks are clever, versatile birds who don't feel confined by their immediate surroundings. If they sense that a change of scenery is needed, they'll merely walk, swim, or fly off to someplace new. Ducks balance their need between slumber and safety by shutting down half of the brain while the other half remains watchful, a tool that allows for quick reactions when necessary. Be mindful to an opportunity that is currently or will soon present itself to you. Although you don't normally make hasty decisions, this situation will call for a swift action because timing is everything here. Do not worry that you will come to the wrong conclusion. React with faith in knowing that whatever your decision it will be the right choice. Today's affirmation for the duck. I trust my instincts and take action when opportunity knocks. I am open to change and welcome new opportunities into my life. So this is very beautiful. All right. So what kind of actions are the angels and the divine asking for? This is the action change the versatility of the duck. So action could actually be taking steps, physical steps to going and doing something or taking your hand and going and doing something. It does not mean that it's just by faith and you just think the thought because that is not the action. Action means movement. And what movement do you need to do to make change or to become versatile? So just as the duck physically moves when it's time for a change or when it feels like it's in danger, it does not just sit there. It moves out of the way. So if you are, you know, if it's hungry, it dives deep into the water and eats. There is a physical action that happens for movement, a physical movement. So I really want to iterate that sometimes when we say action and stuff, we're just not standing still. We're not just thinking it. We're actually moving, like I'm moving my hands. We're moving. We're doing something. Sometimes it's, you know, moving past ego to go and do the logical thing, which is wisdom. Wisdom is on the right side of us. And this is duck is um, looking towards this masculine this action side now the work that everyone does now like going to a job is not the same as physical manifestations but there's still an action there's still a movement that you must do for physical things to come in so as though that things are going to be moving moving <laughs> moving uh, quickly here to know that the duck knows exactly what to do, where to go. So be a duck and follow the duck and be versatile too. It doesn't mean that you do the same thing over and over and over again, right? Sometimes in our day, we need to break it up into something else and do something to get us out of an old pattern. So don't just stay into a routine that doesn't serve you that doesn't give you or even your body that the 
uh, one to say to amplify itself to bring the goodness and uh, beautiful things to you so say for instance that you're living in a house that's full of mold you don't stay there <laughs> right it's making you sick so you either take care of the mold by using bleach and water and spraying it or you move out of the house and ask for help for things to uh, kill the bacteria so the house is livable again you just don't stay where you're being sick you don't stay in where you're being toxic that things are eroding so you want to be in the place that's amplification that brings your body into healing and to health and vitality because everything is bringing into vitality of life so think of Eve she would be on the right side she is a woman of wisdom who knew that she was like God that's why she did not choose the tree of life she chose the tree of good and evil so that we have conscience we know right from wrong she is a woman that is like God who is Michael and Michelle Michaela all of those names mean who is like God is the likeness of God so remember that when you think of duck and remember in the knowledge there is a lot of heart that is going on and a lot of root system into your throat and to communication and how you speak to others as well so thank you for joining me in your Capricorn daily reading with the animal planets the power animal plants the spiritual plant animals of the planet and thank you for giving me those hearts please leave a comment down below and how are you stuck are you in a toxic place well let's get you out of that so what actions can you do to get yourself out of that area in that environment Please uh, feel free to share and also be a part of my family by hitting the like button and hit the all so that you get all of my daily videos. Thank you for joining me again. This is Elena with Angel Messages with Elena and on Etsy, I am the Star of Destiny.